What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of GTA Online. Welcome to part two of act three of this Doomsday Heist series. We just finished up mission one in the last episode and uh, now we're going to see what prep and mission two have to offer. So let's go ahead and boot this thing up. Here we go. Prep Chernabog. Steal a Chernabog ballistic missile launcher from Meriwether Security. Are you serious, dude? We're going to steal a missile launcher. All right, I'm down. Let's see what we can do. Why does Meriwether have one of these things? They're a private army in a city. Like, why do you need a ballistic missile launcher? I don't know. I'm not going to judge them. We're just going to take it from them. This should be really interesting. <laughs> oh, man. It just never ends, dude. We had this in the last episode, too. I don't understand why people can't just let us play the dang game. I'm just like, normally I'd be all for it. I love competing in GTA Online, but like, I just want to focus on the missions right now. Like, that, that is what I want to do. I want to focus on completing these missions. And all of these guys just keep, <laughs> keep coming after us, dude. We got to go. Hopefully he doesn't rocket us. I'm gonna stay low, try to evade him. I don't know, I, I can't tell if these guys are like fans or maybe anti-fans, haters, whatever. I can't tell if they know me from the videos or I, maybe people are just really active in GTA Online today and they just want some action. I'm not sure. I mean, it's it's cool. I, I like the challenge, but it's also kind of frustrating. Wow. Um, he's making me rethink my entire existence here. Whatever. In the wise words of Drake, YOLO. We've got kind of like a little head glitch type thing here. Ash boys, you might be getting flanked. Ooh. I'm actually semi close to dying. It's making me a bit nervous. Not really sure where this guy is. The driver's out of the cab. Take yes. and run. All right. We've got a Ballistic missile launcher. All right. Now the problem with this is we're gonna have everybody and their mother trying to take us out. That's the main issue. Most importantly, that stupid guy over by our base. He knows this is what we're doing, I'm sure. So he's gonna be back there waiting for us and he could potentially destroy this thing. Which I don't like. We'll see what happens, dude. This thing is hella slow. The good news is our facility is very close to the, the base. Ooh. And we've got our friends behind us. They flew down in the tunnel behind us. That's beautiful, dude. That's amazing. The only thing I hope is that they clear... Clear the base. The money is all that matters for us. This thing is so slow. I don't know what I was expecting though. Of course it's gonna be slow. Psychos killed Bebo. Oh dude. I think he just killed our I think he killed our our team. 
We're gonna die here, aren't we? Oh shoot. I'm just driving, I almost forgot where we were going. No. Nope. Shit. We did it. Come on. Yes! Oh my goodness. If I would have died right there because we overshot the turn, I would have been so upset. But we got it. Chertabog delivered. Ah. Now we're going to have to deal with these guys. I mean, that was only prep mission though. So we're going to be able to go straight into another mission. We won't have to deal with them until we come back into another lobby in like 15 minutes. So hopefully they get bored during the time it takes us to, uh, to complete that prep. Stand your ground. Capture the, oh, I think that's in, that's an extra like bonus GT online session challenge. We did it. That was, that was the prep right there. That was actually the quickest prep that we've ever had. That took like five minutes. That was good stuff. They did have a lot of firepower in there, but it really wasn't that hard. Okay, here we go, guys. We're gonna head back into the lab. We're gonna be moving on to act three, mission two. This is gonna be awesome. Here we go, boys. Escort ULP. Use the Chernabog to escort and protect Agent ULP as he makes his escape from his captors. Well, guys, I have no clue where Bebo went. He's, uh, he's still in the lobby, but he's not accepting any of his invites. I tried PSN messaging him, too. He didn't answer back, so we've got Tayson768 here. A level... Is that... Is that legit? Is there a way to reset your level? There's no way. There's no way he's level one. I just turned on the auto invite and it got him, so I don't know. This this should be interesting. Hopefully he's somebody with like, you know, a second account or something. I don't even think there's a way that you could accept invites yet being level one. Like I'm pretty sure you, it takes you through like a tutorial, doesn't it? Am I crazy? I don't know. That was like five years ago when I did that, so I don't really remember to be honest. But uh, Tayson, let's see what you got, bro. Here we go, guys. This is gonna be interesting, man. Crazy group of ragtag soldiers here, including a guy that's level one and may have possibly not ever played GTA. <gasps> Dude, I'm recording this on the, the 26th of December. What if this guy's a Christmas noob? I doubt it, dude. I don't think, I don't think he is. Go to the Polito Bay construction yard. All right. It's awfully quiet here. Usually Lester calls us. I'm gonna hop in the Batmobile real quick. Your ballistic missile launcher is in Polito Bay, so head over there. Or just find a nice dark hole to lie down in and cry till this is all over. I feel bad, our level one is the guy that was left by himself. Alright guys, let's do it. <laughs> Alright, we got a plan. We've got a ballistic missile launcher. We've got pretty much everything we need. We've got a Batmobile. We really could come in hot with the missiles. If we needed them. Oh no, we'll... Let's see what's going on. Dang it. Come on now. Keep it together, Trev. We got this. Whew. Honestly, probably might be a good idea for us to kind of lay off the, uh, the rocket booster a little bit, but I'm not going to. By the way, I got your control freaks using them now. Ash boys, you're the man, bro. Thank you. I hope you like them. They're really interesting. They're one of the more unique additions of control freaks. All right, coming into Polito Bay here. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh, 
overshot our turn just a little bit. We're fine though. Free parking in that parking spot for the next few days. Oh no. I'm just gonna start firing missiles then. Come on. No way. He's got a bunch of clones. I'm just gonna keep using our missile launcher here. There's no reason to do anything else. Look at this. Come on, come on, come on. Oh! The three piece. Another one back there. What else do we have? Dude, this thing is so good. It's gotta make sure we don't blow up what we don't wanna blow up. Blow up the objective or something. It's like a boomerang missile that almost came back around and got us. One last guy out here. He's down. A couple extra shots. Here we go. Alright. Hold right to enable or disable the missile launcher for the passenger. Shoot, hold on. Ash boys, get in here, bro. So we've got a, a missile launcher as well as two ramp cars. We've gotta get over and oh, oh. <laughs> We've gotta get over and protect the package. Let's do it, boys. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Those ramp cars are awesome, dude. Oh, so we still have Avon's men coming after us. Those are kind of cool trucks, though. I like the black and purple. That looks good. So the ramp cars get these guys off of us, and then we protect ULP. Some better music in here. All right, we made it. Here's the landing site. Okay, we activated the missile launcher, so now he's gonna be able to shoot. He's straight out in front of us. Coming over the water. I'm gonna put this on blonded. So we can't drive when this is activated. This guy? You got this, Ash Boys. I believe in you, bro. Do you have lock-on missiles? Nice. There it is. We get that second guy, though. Okay. Follow and protect Agent ULP. Oh, we're gonna... We're gonna have to move, aren't we? Go ahead and back this thing up and start moving. Go ahead and shoot him. You got him? Gonna protect that. Dude, he is in such a tiny little chopper. That is almost impossible to see. Why couldn't we give him one of the, the giant stealth choppers? I feel like that would have been more useful. So we're just gonna have to slowly work our way up up the path here. Ash Boys shoots. Can he not reach him there? He might not be able to reach him there. Ash Boys shoots and I drive. Oh, there we go. We got one. Okay. This is kind of challenging. Shoot him real quick. Alright, 
I think we have to go down here. We don't want to go in the cave. We aren't going to be able to protect the chopper from the cave. So we're going to go down here. Oh, no. I don't know how we're... Okay, here we go. Nice. Let her rip! We got a bunch of choppers here. Protect him. I wish I knew how this worked. Does he have... It looks like he has auto-aim, yeah. Can he shoot the stuff down the ground, though? That's the question. I think he has to be closer for the, uh... For the lock-on. Let's go, Tayson 768. That's what I'm talking about. Hit him! Okay. Alright, got that one. There's a couple more. Our own ramp car just hit us. Let's go. <laughs> this is insanity, dude. I'm starting to take a little bit of damage, but I'm alright. I love the ramp cars, how they're just sitting there protecting us, taking care of us at all times. I'm going to catch back up to Agent ULP here. Try to get ahead of him. Stop. Give him access to the missiles. Ooh, be careful. They're kind of surrounding him. That could have been bad. That could have been a danger close scenario. Got that last one. All right. Working like a fluid machine now. I dig this. I need one of these ramp cars. This guy's like stuck to me. I literally cannot get him off of me. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. We're okay. I'm gonna pause and let him shoot. Got three choppers right here. I don't know if he can see them when they're this close. Nice. Last one right there. Good stuff. We're looking pretty good here. I would say overall we're, we're doing all right. Getting a little bit overwhelming with this many guys down on the ground shooting us, but we're okay. So it looks like he took a right up here. So we're gonna go forward and take a right. Woo. I'm gonna get ahead just a little bit. I like getting ahead because then we don't have to worry about a whole lot else. Get ahead. Put it down right here. There we go. This is sick, dude. Oh, there's a couple right above us. I don't think he's going to be able to reach those. Get that second one. There we go. Alright, we're off. I'm confused as to where the chopper's going. I thought it was gonna be taking a right, but it's kind of just going out beyond the road or beyond the lake. Shit. Go for it. The safe house is inland from there. Keep following. Watch the six. We got him. Probably shouldn't have gone off-roading in this thing. It does have at least eight tires. I've got a couple more choppers. Just gotta get up here to the right. <laughs> you got that tractor. We gotta get up here to the right. Get the right here. Woo! 
Safe house is in sight. There we go. That should take care of one. We've got two more here. There's two. Third one's right here. Actually, there's more than that. We gotta get going. Look at this big thing, dude. This is nuts. Alright, we've got two in front of us. I'm gonna try to get some distance. This is all you, bro. You got this? Dude, these guys just don't stop. Every time I think there's only a couple left, another one shows up. Look at this one. He's looking at us, too. right in front of us of course all right we've got some more guys coming i want you under that chopper like you're in shadow protected with everything you got i got you lester how much farther do we have to go man like i said we should have freaking Should have just put him in the armored chopper that could defend itself. Right, should be able to get these guys here. Nice and easy. Close. Easy shots. Got two more up there. Nice job. Oh gosh. Woo! That was close, protege. <laughs> these things keep landing in the middle of the street in front of us. Got a few more here. I wonder what it looks like from his end. I wish I could see it. I wish we could like switch halfway through. Ooh, that guy went behind the billboard. All right, good work. I think Protege's getting out and shooting stuff down himself. That's good stuff. I wonder if we could do that. Could we like hit the Oh my gosh, I thought we were going to fail. I was going to say if we could like hit the button to to set it down and then hop out and use our own launcher. Holy cow, I thought that we just failed that. I was going to be so upset. All right, guys, there you have it. Quick little prep mission there. The actual mission itself was kind of long, but really easy. That's mission two. Hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you guys want to see more. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.